So I just finished watching The Real Housewife of Dubai. Oh my God, it's so good. I mean, I was hooked after 10 minutes. Um, I wasn't going to watch the show because of the whole Puerto party. You know what I mean? Like, we're Arab and shit on people's face and you have to eat it. And also because, like, the majority of people in Dubai do not live like that. Um, so I wasn't going to watch it. But after 10 minutes in, baby, I was sold. It was giving rich, okay? It was giving uh, the other franchises a run for their money. Uh-huh. So Let's meet the class. So the episode opened up with Chanel. Um, she is the type of housewife I like. She's borderline obnoxious. She's shady. She's loud. Um, she's rich and she's sunny. She tell you how it is. Um, next, it was Stanberry, I believe. Um, it, uh, there's not much. I, you know, next. Uh, we have Brooks, Brooks, and Kim Michelle are alike. They look the same and they shade the same. They're messy, okay? Messy as hell. You have Nina. With Nina, I didn't really watch her scene like that, so her little bio is right there. Lisa, gorgeous. She she has a beautiful family. She's, I believe she was Miss um, Jamaica. I don't know. I might be wrong. But um, she has a beautiful family. Her and Chanel are really good friends. Then we have Sarah, gorgeous Muslim sister. Um, she's a rebel. I'm excited to see um, her on the show and how she will fit in with these girls. The beef di um, this season, I think it will be Stanberry and Chanel. It is going to give us a Nene Leaks and Kim feud, a long-lasting feud. I'm here for it. And next few would be the Brooks versus um, Chanel. Is giving um, frenemy friendship, just like Giselle from The Real Housewife of Potomac and Queen Karen. Jealous, that's why you this is why I think you? this show is what going to be messy like as hell. Me, look at your face, look at my face. Chanel, this. 